Hello. Welcome back to the show that never knows where to go. It's Lost Horizon. Look, no time for chit chat at all. We're stuck in a damn ice cave. And worse, Kim's up here by herself, hiding behind a truck with a barracks of Nazis here. Not not like Twitter Nazis, actual Nazis. I told her not to come. Did she listen? No. Why would she do that? And if you remember, and I hope you do, because I I barely do. We're trying to get out through this crevice here by melting something, but it's not working. And I'm kind of stumped. I was kind of stumped. Wait a minute. Was that there the whole time? Hey, a pocket knife. Of course. <sighs> All the blades are broken off. Why on earth wouldn't they be? I should have known. Pixel hunts. Oh well, the corkscrew's still. Ah, uh, pixel hunts. Someone had their priorities right. Okay. This log has a Yeah, I remember Let's that. See what I can call not much, as it turns out. But I've used the corkscrew to pull out the knot. Okay. We tried this before, right? Okay, let's try again. Yeah, that didn't work. All quiet in the far east. Water boils, steam escapes through the hole in the lid. The hole in the lid. Can we put the bung hole in the okay, bung hole? I've stuck the wood chip into the hole in the lid. All right. Let's see what happens next. Try again. The practical side of physics isn't bad. The wooden bullet thing went straight through the ceiling of ice. Nice. We do have a grappling hook we made last time. Aim well. Nice. Well, look at that. School science did teach me something useful after all. The pressure shot. Can we? It's got a handsome look. Can I take the pot back? Ouch, ouch, ouch. Hot. Okay, let's go tell Kim. Is she coming with us? It's too high and icy. I need another way out. I better make sure I don't join him. Okay. Uh, maybe we'll get you from the other side. Up the grappling hook. That must be the tent we saw from above. Oh yeah, that's where they're storing the um, okay. the British POWs. Well, it's, they're not POWs because they're not a war. This is before they even invaded Poland. Can I open the gate and get Kim? There's no gate. Let's see if I can use any of this. Well, on the plus side... Oh, they gave me a grenade. On it's over. Side, it's most likely a dud. I want a grenade. A stick grenade. German model. The fuse is missing. Okay. Let's, get, let's see if there's a gate up here first. Truck. There's one just like that standing in front of the gate. Might come in handy sometime, but I have to take care of other things first. This looks like a radio shack. Can we get in here? Locked. I can't go any further. There's a guard up in that hut. Granted, he appears to be sleeping, but I'd rather not take the risk. There's a guard? Where's a guard? Oh, here. Judging by the engine noise and the smell, there are diesel generators in this shed. Okay. Oh, there's another German. Hold on. Stop, stop, stop.
Looks like he's repairing the truck. The truck bonnet's being held up by that beam. A portable welding machine. Okay. A toolbox. Can we get in there and shut off the generator to pull him out of there? Locked. The generator motor sucks in air through this opening. Oh, just block it. It'll shut the, shut it off. Here. Cram some newspapers there. Cram some newspapers in there! What's wrong with that? Can we jam it up with some record pieces? Why do I still have this record? I literally carried this down off the mountain. Now, where did I get that? Oh, yeah. No, where did I get that? I don't even remember. Can I dump water in there? The water would cause yes. a short circuit. Sounds promising. Oh, What's happened now? What are you gonna do, dude? Must be the generator. What now? Can't stay in there forever. Nice. Hello? Hilfe! Can anyone hear me out there? Something's blocking the door. Hello? Good thing the generator in the other hut's loud enough to drown out his shouting. So why is he yelling in English when everybody around him would be German? Toolbox. It won't budge. The lid seems to be jammed. Uh, let's try this. Unfortunately, the corkscrew isn't at all suited for prying open the jammed lid. I say it is. Just try. Let's blow it up. No. Beat it with this. No. Okay. We'll come back to that, I guess. I wanted to see if the gate was down here, but I guess it's not. Okay, I'll ask you again. How did the monk and your lieutenant escape the monastery? Which secret passage did they use? We can go on like this for days. I have hundreds of these records, and you seem to enjoy the music. Or surely you would object. <laughs> if it's still too quiet, I'd be happy to turn up the volume. My word, it's Thomas. Thomas Finch. He's an officer in Richard's unit. I knew him from the service back in Hong Kong. It looks like they're torturing him with German marching music. It's booming through his headphones. A fate worse than death. I could deal with better than poker. If he wasn't as wide as a door frame. Since I left my black belt at home, I'll have to be a bit more subtle. This guy's a machine. One on one, he'd mince me. A tent peg. A Nazi uniform. Um. I could just grab him from behind, but he doesn't look like an amateur. I need to get Thomas's attention and double team this guy. Of course. He's too busy enjoying German marching music. There must be, conservatively, about 5,000 German marching records here. Uh-oh. And now I have something very special for you. Let's see how you like this. Something tells me you'll become very talkative very soon. <laughs> if I put on our record, can, I could get his attention, right? I can't get over there without getting caught by Mr. Kick My Ass. But uh, my record's broken as shit. Oh, no. 
I don't think Brutus is all that bright, but stupid enough to play a broken record? Perhaps not. Okay. Thomas's headphones are plugged into this player. I'll never make it over there without being noticed by Max Schmeling's big brother. Interesting. Let's go back out. Poor Thomas is just going to have to endure that for a little bit. Locked. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Can I use this, uh, this ten peg to get in this toolbox? Yes, I can use this to lift the lid a bit. Let's see what I can pull out through the gap. What the hell's that? We got a vice, some glue, and a saw blade in the cover. A saw blade. I'll take it out of the cover. Yeah, do that. Let's put it in the vice. No, don't put it in the vice. Empty cover. Can we use the glue on the album? Yes. I the edges of the pieces with glue. Now they just need to go back together. Okay, pick up the pieces by left clicking them. Each left click turns them clockwise 90 degrees. I can pick up, turn, and set down the pieces. No reason why I shouldn't be able to handle this. If I can get How them lined up right, I should have no problems. Oh, okay, I gotta do it up there. That's weird. Okay. Uh, let's this start with the. This is probably a good starting point. Yeah, that's what I was just picking it up for. You I'll don't need to tell me that, dude. Big piece. Stop! Oh, they're they. They're leaving it there. I can't pick that one up. That's why. That's why he was yelling at me. Start with the label because that's obviously the easiest. Okay. I think I think I'm gonna ace this. I think I, I think I got this one in the bag. Let's see. Looking for this thing. Here it is. My keen sense of deduction. Looking for this thing. Here it is. Looking for this one. Dude, this would never play in a million years. You ain't fooling me. Uh, I don't think that's it. I think this might be it. This looks like it goes here. Which means this one goes here. I don't know where that one goes. Don't judge me. Oops. Job done. I've glued the record back together. Of course, the light colored glue in the cracks won't stand up to scrutiny. At all. So what's he trying to tell me there? Perfect fit. I'll slide it in carefully. All right, let's try this again now. Without a cover, he'll notice straight away. Where do I get a cover? Can I take I one? can't get over there without getting caught by Mr. Kick My Ass. Without a cover. I'll take the record back out. Don't 
Do I have some way to make? Oh, what about newspaper? We could jazz up this cover with that picture of the soldiers from the newspaper. But we need to... I put some glue on the back of the newspaper page. Now I can stick the picture of the soldiers somewhere. Stick it on your butt. Perfect. We've got marching soldiers on the front cover. Hey, maybe I'll sell this as a collector's item instead. All right, let's try this now. If I'm lucky, Hans won't notice it's not marches. Something tells me Thomas will. What the? This record has been glued back together. What idiot did this? Didn't even work. I went through Dad, all that. He noticed the glued cracks and threw the record out. Okay, maybe we gotta do a little more work on it. Here, pick that back up. He, he had a good arm. Okay, let's take... I've glued the pieces back together. It's whole again. You could almost mistake... Okay, so how do we make this record look better? We can melt it, except we we shut down the we shut down the welding machine. Can we get back in the toolbox and pull something else out? Hmm. What do I have that could work on this record? Ice? Why would ice? Why would ice do anything? Ice isn't gonna do anything, right? I've glued the pieces back to. Okay, he's got an idea here. I know. I know some people watch this that got big brains. might come in handy sometime, but I have to take care of- Yeah, 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 shut up! What, what am I missing? I don't, I don't want to open that door. There's a German, a, a mad German locked inside. A portable welding machine. What good is the saw blade? Can't get over there without getting caught by Mr. Kick My Ass. I can't get his attention while he's plumbed into the German marching. Oh, come on! I thought I was doing good. I thought I had it all worked out. How do you make a glued together record not look glued together? I've glued the pieces back together. It's whole again. Fenton managed to sneak into the German camp by way of an underground system of caves. Now he needs to rescue the British officer. Hmm. A Nazi uniform.
Wait, 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 wait. What if I go back down in the cave? There's a fire down there. What if I melt my record a little bit? Oh, come on, that was a good idea. No. Nope. Point blank refuse. What if I... Oh, wait, 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 wait. What if we heat up the steam again? I've already destroyed the layer of ice in the ceiling. Impromptu bolt projectile apparatus are fun, but I don't really need to construct another one. Yeah, you do, because then I can use the steam to... Idiot. What if I freeze the glue? Not, not, not that I thought that would have any actual honest application. A saw blade. Yeah, I know it's a saw blade. Shit. Can I get into here now? Is there something in here? Locked. Where's my ten peg? Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> All right. Let me play around a little bit. Um, as always, I don't mind showing myself struggling a little bit. But I don't necessarily think it's good. I mean, I don't have any good content anyway. But I don't think showing myself struggling for 40 minutes is good content. Or it's even worse content than I normally make. So I'll pause it. I'll keep playing around. And then we'll, um, we'll come back. Just, just give me a second to play. Hello, and welcome back. And I've made no progress. I've made none progress. I've glued the pieces back together. It's whole again. You could almost mistake it. I'm stumped. Just kind of been walking around in circles thinking. A bottle of glue. A vice. Is a vice of any use for a record? I can't imagine it would be. We've already used the glue. I can't imagine a saw blade would be good. I can't imagine a hand grenade would be good. I've glued the pieces back together. How do you hide... How do you hide glue marks? Is this coal? Is this a coal bin? I can't go any further. There's a guard up in that hut. It is a coal bin. To be sleeping. Or it looks like one, but... I'd rather not take the risk. I can't, I can't activate it, I can't, let's go back down and look at the fire again. No, no, and no again. I don't see any ash or soot down here, or dirt, right, that would be a way to I mean, the record's already going to sound horrible. Might as, well, might as well rub some dirt on it. Okay. Work through what you know. What do, what do we know? We need to play the record to free Thomas. Or play the record to signal to Thomas. 
that something different that we're here to make them look up whatever because it's English music obviously we can't get this record past the guard because it's too obviously butchered because you can see all the glue cracks in there okay how do you hide the glue cracks paint we don't have any paint there's no dirt we can't use the coal I tried to use the fire to melt it a little bit that didn't work we can't operate the, the, the welding machine for any reason Why can't we just hit him in the back of the head with a grenade? Uh, that's what I would do. Can we ch chip off some wood, but what good would that do? That would do absolutely no good. We can randomly try to combine things in our inventory. When you're stuck in an adventure game, which I almost never am, to be honest. Like, sometimes I... Sometimes. Just randomly try to combine stuff in your inventory. Because sometimes that'll bail you out. Although it does not look like that's going to be happening this time. This is a method I used often when we were playing... Um, Mysterious Island. I mean... In that game, I knew exactly what I was doing all the time. It just looked like I was just randomly combining stuff. I unscrewed the top Whoa. of the grenade and poured out the See? gunpowder. See, I, I knew that the whole time. It's gunpowder from a grenade. Can we use that to cover the cracks? The gunpowder sticking to the glue in the cracks. Nice. You can hardly see them. The record looks as good as new. That's right. Hey, maybe I'll sell this as a collector's item instead. I knew what I was doing. Okay, now. Now let's try this again. If I'm lucky, hands won't notice it's not marches. Something tells me Thomas will. Okay, here comes a real smasher. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. I meant that to happen. Job done. Hope no one heard the explosion. That's funny. Thomas? Wait, I'll take off the headphones. Fenton? Fenton? Paddock? What the hell are you doing here? I'll explain later. You have to listen to me now. We don't have much time. Uh, I need to know what happened here. I need to know what happened. I suppose we were in the wrong place at the wrong time. What do you mean? Well, our mission was to survey the area. Richard's maps were taking us towards some key defense points. An old monastery set near a valley. It was dark when we got here. The search for the monastery was due to begin the following morning. We were prepping our gear and setting up camp when we heard explosions. The monastery was set on a mountain slope, and we could make out someone trying to blast open the entrance. We couldn't tell, but we assumed they were bandits. Richard ordered an attack. The maps showed a second, hidden entrance to the monastery. So we took a team up and made contact with the monks. We got in touch with the abbot, or whatever they call him, but we were too late. They stormed the main entrance. Yeah. We were massively outnumbered. Didn't have a chance. The old monk hid Richard. Can we speed it up? We're in the middle of a German scared. camp. Didn't think he'd make it. He told us just the highlights. We were to remember at all costs. And what was that? He said, "The door is guarded by two dragons, Yao the Strong and Zhao the Wise. Zhao, the mother, is twice as old as her son, Yao. Something like that." Should anyway, I write that down? He made it along with Richard. But I should have wrote that down. Wound up here. 
I only realized then why we were overrun. Nazis put up a better fight than bandits, I guess. I'm going to write that down. Hold on. What was it? Zhao. I'm just going to put Z times two old as... What was the other one? Xiao? Shoot. I don't remember if Zhao or Xiao was the older one. And, the, and Xiao was the son. So a mother and a son? Okay. We'll, we'll ask if he's okay. I don't really care. Are you okay? Fenton, you're back with the forces. Where's the rescue unit? No. Listen to me, Thomas. Is everything okay? Are you injured? Well, my ears are still ringing a bit, and I'm pretty knackered. They haven't let me sleep for three days. Can you stand up? Not as long as I'm handcuffed to this crate. Okay. I can take care of that. What are the Germans doing here, anyway? What are they doing? They found something very exciting in the monastery. But I haven't the faintest idea what it is. In any event, it's important enough to the boss around here, that Countess von Hagenhilt, to slaughter innocent monks. They kept asking me how to open the secret chamber, but I, I didn't give them anything. I suppose whatever they're looking for is in there. You mean you didn't tell them anything about this dragon code? No, not a word. Dragon code. <laughs> what happened to Richard? I, I assume he and the monk made it to the chamber, but I, I really don't know. So Richard might still be there? Maybe, if they had some supplies. But he might even have made it out. Well, whichever the case, I'm going to find him. That chamber. Where exactly is it? In a kind of courtyard. There's a secret mechanism on the west wall. Right. I, I always had a theory that if you add fist to a band name, it always makes it better. Like Tokyo Motor Fist, or Razor Fist, or Skull Fist. They're all great band names. But maybe... Maybe Dragon's even better. Dragon Razor. Dragon Fist. I got I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to think about that one. Maybe just Dragon Fist is like the best band name ever. It it, it could be. Copyrighted, don't take it. Thomas, do you have any idea how we can get out of here? You're a card. The best thing would be to leave the same way you came, don't you think? Uh yeah, we can forget about that. I kind of fell down a crevasse. Besides, you don't look like you're up for any sheer rock faces quite yet. There are trucks leaving the camp several times a day. Maybe that's an option. Sounds interesting. Okay, I'll find something to unlock the cuffs. Might I suggest the key? Oh, yeah. No, don't. No, no, look up here. We can probably get a key. Just take really the uniform. Nice size, but what's this in the pockets? Keys. Oh, wait, what else do we get? A taped recording of the interrogation. Oh, that might be good for me to re remember the Dragon Fist code. Here, Thomas. Perfect. The smallest key fits. The cuffs are open. Thomas, let's get out of here. Can you walk? I've had better days. Maybe you better hang here until I can find us a way out. I'll check out the trucks. Get out of here in style. Okay, can we... Thomas is waiting here until I... Oh, I was going to say, can I put on the uniform? But now I got this weird Thomas icon. Let's go back to that truck. Dude, just put on the I'll uniform. The uniform on first. Yeah, thank you. Blend in with Holy shit, I've been wanting you to do that forever. Okay, uh, can we put Thomas in the truck? Hey, yeah. I can just drive Thomas out of here. I can hide him in the back of the truck. If we make it past the gate, we're home dry. Okay, Thomas is hiding in the back of the truck. If my luck holds, then the keys and the ignition. Uh-oh. Hey, what are you doing there, Junge? I, um... <clears throat> oh, another one caught the bug. It's this weather. I've had a cold this entire time. Yeah, <coughs> can hardly speak. Don't worry about it. You wanted to go to the monastery, did you? Yes. Mm -hmm. Did the men up there order another truck? At this time of the day? <coughs> 
I've told those fools a hundred times that I will not allow a convoy to drive up there at this time of the day. They better learn to stick to the rules. No truck leaves the base after 1600, unless they've made a find of utmost priority up at the monastery. That's 830, What's all this about anyway? What needs to be picked up so urgently? Well... What did they say on the radio? Whatever, I just need the military assignment form. Filled out in full. Have them give you one in the radio room. If the finds are particularly important, I can send you up with a truck. I'll be in the barracks. But don't come back unless we're talking really important finds. Otherwise, we'll have it picked up in the morning. Very well. Radio room, form, and important find. Off we go. Okay. This is a radio room right here. I know that. I can tell that by the antenna. Dude, I should have just hit that guy with my dragon fist. Boom! And just drove off. Drove off. Why are we why are we jerking around here? Break out the dragon fist. It's always the last key, isn't it? Doors open. Thank goodness. Nobody here. Okay. I think we're gonna stop here for today. We made pretty good progress, surprisingly. Considering what an idiot I am. I mean that that gunpowder from the grenade is just that's a little obtuse. I gotta be honest with you. The clues were there, right? When we put the record together, he said it's something about the light glue lines or something. But the fact that I had to unscrew the grenade and it, I, who even knew you could unscrew a potato masher like that? Anyway, we lucked through it. We'll pick up here probably tomorrow. We'll keep going. We gotta get to the monastery and see what's going on. Learn about some dragon code. And that's it. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. And we'll see you next time on Lost Horizon. Bye now.